Hey guys, welcome back to another video. On the screen right now, you can see the short interest for AMC Entertainment, ticket symbol AMC. Right now, our shares on loan is sitting at 181.87 million, which is an all time high for AMC. As you guys can see, compared to seven days ago at 174 million, uh, close to 175 million we went up by close to six to seven million shares on loan with a change of 3.98 percent now this is extremely important and i'm about to show you guys the graph right now which indicates why we're about to see the squeeze happening for amc this is extremely important and i want everyone to listen closely and watch until the end of the video i'll make it as simple as possible to understand if you guys did find it useful or enjoyed it feel free to click that like and subscribe button none of this financial advice without any further ado let's get straight into the video so on the screen right now you can see the chart. Obviously, this is the price of AMC. This particular pink line is the shares on loan, right? And so we can see before the whole craziness happened with AMC, we see the shares on loan increasing. Now, just to put into perspective and go onto the chart, this is before the craziness happened, right? We saw AMC doing extremely well. We saw it go from $5 all the way to that $14 mark, but then that massive takeoff happened. So the shares on loan already was increasing. Now bear in mind at that time, the all time high shares on loan was sitting at 152.83 million. So we're actually 30 million higher than that as of right now. This is very important. So we were at 152.83 million. And then you guys can see as the shares on loan decreased, we saw the price going up. That is because of a result of people having to reduce their position, obviously talking about the short positions. This is when the quote unquote mini squeeze happened for AMC. And so we can see the price going all the way up, all the way up, all the way up where you guys can see it went from 152.83 down to 131.83 and even down to that low of 85.17 million. This is when AMC price was at its high, you know, booming when it was actually sitting down up at this area. We saw it go all the way up. Sorry for keeping right clicking. We saw it go all the way up to that $72 mark, but obviously we ended up closing at 47.91 when the shares on loan was at sitting 131.83 million. But when the price was actually sitting very high, when the price was actually sitting and closing at $50, $60, the shares on loan was 88.43 million. Due to a result of this, the big firms, big institutions obviously start having to put borrow shares on loan again, start shorting these positions. And then you guys can see the correlation as the price goes down and down and down. The shares on loan are increasing, 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 where we went from that 85.17 million all the way up to that 158.23 million. And again, right now of 181.87 million. But you guys can see this correlation of the shares on loan increasing and the price decreasing. And so that is obviously very understandable in simpler terms. When the shares on loan increases, obviously there are more short positions. And because there are more short positions, the likelihood of AMC or rather that pushes the price of AMC down. So this is what gets interesting. And this is why I'm bringing this to everyone's attention. So we actually have the current price of AMC sitting at 11.86 million. Right now, for the past few days, we can see the AMC price going down, but we can also see the shares on loan going up. We also have the short interest going up as well, guys. We have the short interest going up, sitting at 23.37%. And so with all of this, right, with all of this, it's just pointing to one thing. It's pointing to the squeeze happening. And this squeeze right now is going to be a way bigger squeeze than the ones we've seen here. The reason for this is because we've accumulated so much more investors throughout this whole journey. We have more and more people buying into this. And most importantly, we have more people being educated on how to further maximize the profit for when the squeeze does happen. If you guys want to make sure everyone understands what's happening, make sure to share this video so far if you have found it useful. But the reason why I say this is because everyone should understand, and again, this is not financial advice, when the squeeze does happen, feel free to do whatever you want. But 
as you hold on longer when the squeeze happens, the likelihood of the price going higher is even higher. So the longer you hold during the squeeze, and that's assuming the majority of people hold as well, the likelihood of you selling at a higher position and the likelihood of seeing AMC going to a higher price position is extremely possible. And so more people are educated, and this is what makes us more powerful. So that is kind of why this is getting exciting, why this is getting interesting. You know, a lot more people are educated, a lot more people are into this now. We have a lot more investors now than we did back then. Right now, everyone is paying attention to this. Right now, everyone is keeping a close eye to the shares on loan. You know, with everything that's about to happen, it will be a huge thing. This could even trigger a market crash. It could trigger big firms really losing out a lot of money, but this will be a time when retail investors win. You know, everything right now is building for us at 181.87 million. And just as you guys can see, before the price took off, we were seeing the all-time high share loan, 152.83 million. Obviously, this was back then. And then when eventually they had to cover the positions, when our long position took over, the price went up and they had to cover the positions. And likelihood of us seeing this happening again is very likely. And this time, the difference is there is 30 million. And guys, these are just the shares we know. Obviously, there are synthetic shares. There are shares we don't know about. We're talking about the shares that we all know. One thing is for sure, the synthetic shares now is a lot more than before. AMC wasn't in a point where they needed a lot of synthetic shares back then as they are now. So when all of this happened, it is going to trigger a massive effect. And I, this is extremely, extremely profitable for us retail investors. Obviously, we have to place close attention. Obviously, we have to understand exactly what is going on. End of the day, big firms have a lot of things over us. But what we can do is get that edge of understanding what is happening and how we can play it to our advantage. But yeah, guys. 30 million more shares on loan, not even talking about the synthetic shares. Seeing the same kind of cycle, the same kind of data, the same kind of movement happening where the price is consolidating, we see the price consolidating, the shares on loans increasing, increasing, increasing. Maybe the likelihood of us seeing something like this happen, maybe we could we could only be in the first part of the cycle, as you guys can see here. We first got on loan 1087 108.87 million before the price, the shares on loan kind of took a tank and then it went up. If this is what we're seeing, we could be just seeing the first cycle or we are just going to see suddenly the price take off because they have to cover their position. Bear in mind, guys, another thing that has changed is that all these short positions have been paying fees every single day for the past few months to keep their short positions alive, guys. And right now, these money are small pocket changes for them. But these things add up. And once they, you know, get to that point where they can't hold on to it anymore, they will have to either double down on this, which will make the loss even bigger, or they'll have to cover the positions. And so that, I think, is extremely important. Anyway, guys, comment down below what you guys think about this. Comment down below how you guys are going to take profit, at what price you guys think it's going to. Is it going to $100 when you guys are going to take your profit? Anyway, guys, if you have found the video useful or enjoyed it, feel free to click that like and subscribe button, and I'll catch you guys next time.